Ecological communities are all around us, whether it's in this forest, on the top of a hill, or in your very own back garden. They are made up of lots and lots of different species, both plants and animals. But more than the number of species, it's the way they interact that really gives a sense of community. You have your predators and your prey. And at this stage, I was hoping for an osprey to come down and swooping into the lake to catch some trout. Typical. Other species compete for limited resources, such as in this forest, where every single tree needs to gain access to some sunlight. It's not all about competition, though. Foxgloves are a great example of how species can benefit one another. Insects enter the flowers to feed on the nectar, and when they fly off, they carry the plant's pollen. All these interactions create an amazing network that truly bring the world around us to life. And this is what I find truly fascinating.